Hey, 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 what's going on, everybody? How is everybody going on today? Hope you guys are doing well on this wonderful Monday evening. Hope everybody's doing well and all is well out in truck lands. So hope you guys are doing well. So let's go ahead and throw some shout outs there. Mr. Andrew Smith with number one. How are you there, Andrew? Good to see you there, Andrew. We got a little more up here. Great Smith's fit. I am Coach Keyhook. You know, I'm just joshing with you there, e Keyhook. I hope you're doing well, man. You guys always made me on my uh, my tardiness to the streams, but uh, we are trying to make it better for you. <laughs> yeah, you like how I turned that around, right? All right, what's up there, Thought Slayer? How are you there? Steven Stoke, good to see you guys. Got me the big T, big T up in the house. What's up, man? Gaming with Caesar, what's up? Steven Stoke, what's up, man? I hear you doing waiting for Oregon 2. It's going to be good, man. Country Boy Farm, good to see you there. Jared Clark. We got Cameron Clintock up in here, Jay Cook, Brian Sanders, Raj Lawson. We've got Rest. What's up, buddy? How are you there? Big Steve up in the house. Uh, Cody Wanicott. What's up, man? Hope are you? How, whoa. <clears throat> How are you? Hope you're doing well. I stumbled all over myself there. John Brock Highland Guard. What's up, man? Hope you guys are doing good. We got uh, Trevor Klein up in the house as well. Nice step 83. We got Anthony S. Cameron Bowner. What's up, buddy? Hope you're doing well. Military 4x4. Four four. Marty 24. What's up, man? Kyle Polinski. We got Josh Jones. CJ Kreider. What's up, buddy? Make sure I didn't miss anybody up there on the top. All right, we're called up now. Sebastian, what's up, man? Hope you guys are doing well. CYD, hello. 45 seconds. You guys want to get a last minute shout out here before we start our retro cat Mac attack. This is nice. I've got some nice trailers on here as well. Some that we don't normally do because we always do the really heavy stuff. Uh, but there's some really, really, really nice uh, back end trailers here that are really good. Y'all, of course, they're also going to certainly do, man. James, man, what's up, buddy? Oh, I know. You're right. <laughs> oh, touche, man. Touche. Let's uh, let's take care of that right now. We are, man. Thank you, everybody, for 15,000. Already up to almost 15,200. So there it is, man. Thank you for that. 15,000. Yes, sir, man. Uh, no, Kyle, since we already did the build. We're just going to drive today and chill. I want to talk about some things. We're going to kind of double up this stream. And with you guys to really fill in here and let's talk about Oregon DLC. Let's talk about this company stuff. I've got some announcements here if you weren't here this weekend. But I tell you what, let's go ahead and just roll this music out here and we'll uh, we'll get this stream going here. So, all right, good to have 52 of you here with us. Let's get her started. Be back in 15. All right. Hey, what's going on, everybody? Hope you're doing well. Uh, got the mic on this time. So what's up? So, okay. So, okay. A few things going on here right off the bat. So first off, if you're new, welcome. You're invited to participate here in the chat because the good thing about this one is we won't be doing a building drive. I've got mm, one, two, three, four. No, definitely three, potentially four, but I've got three awesome things that's going to happen this week. Nobody else has got. So I'm super duper excited. Uh, I've got a uh, I've got a a a modder that I'm working with, and woo! Tell you what, man, you guys are gonna be like, oh my gosh. So anyway, that's the little teaser for this week. I'm so already starting to work on some stuff. So today's gonna be a chill drive, but it's also gonna be something where you guys can really plug in and and talk to me uh, as we start getting out on the road here. Start talking thoughts on truck company stuff. Start talking thoughts on Oregon DLC. Uh, just some things, and hopefully when these updates start to come out, uh, so you guys had already asked me last time, you know, hey, what are your thoughts on this? What's it going to be? What do, what do you think it's going to look like? What do you think it's going to, uh, you know, most of that is just all hearsay. It's just whatever it is. But uh, let me let you guys know, before we get started here on our drive, let me go ahead and let you know of a couple things here that you want to make note of. First thing you want to make note of is the truck company just went live Sunday. Uh, no, actually Saturday night. So if you're looking, if you're on ATS and you're looking to join up with a truck company uh, here with ATS, you may say, well, what the heck's a truck company? I mean, I thought you did was drive. Well, it is, but, and then after we welcome their Landon Swift, thank you there, Landon, appreciate it, buddy. Oh, that was Taylor Seitz. Sorry, Taylor Seitz is on, and then Landon Swift is up in a in a in a close second. <laughs> what it did, second. So uh, I was waiting on this, and I'm, I'm sure there it is. We'll let this one go through. There we go. So thank you there, Landon, and thank you there to Taylor uh, Taylor Seitz. All right, and I'll get the shout outs there for the rest of you guys that came in and just said hey. 
Uh, so the first thing's off, if you add them a truck company. So this is with truck books. And what this is is basically a logging book company's website. It's all web-based. And they keep up with all your stuff. Now, typically, I would say there's nothing to do. And it's like, oh, well, it doesn't matter whether or not I log with FTG. It doesn't really care. Let me just tell you, there's all kind of guys already now in the Discord that are starting to kind of convoy up on the on the afternoons and even some during the evenings and driving a lot together, getting loads of different places using the CB. So it's a huge, like, yeah, definite, a, a definite double thumbs up. So thank you there to Zant, uh, Smoke Clone 60 or Smoke uh, Clone G4610. So thank you, everybody. Appreciate that. So look at that. That's going to be really cool. So you click that link, sign up for it. You download a little client, and it'll put that client. Now, it'll, your computer will tell you that it's malware. I promise you it's not. It's just because it's, laid, it's labeled setup. And uh, Windows does not like generic files that are named setup. Um, they just don't. They like for them to have a program name. But anyway, click that, download it in the client, this site, and fill out an application here to uh, FTG United Logistics. And it's a truck company. Now you say, here's the thing. Here's the reward. Once merchandise starts rolling in, we're going to be talking with my merch ladies. Uh, and they're going to be probably this week. Hopefully, we're going to get some prices. We're going to exactly figure out exactly how we want to approach the first part of this. And then we're going to move merch on out of here. Uh, and then I'm going to actually fund every bit of it at first. And then that way, I'll be able to sell and ship right out of my own house. So that way, you guys will have a Shopify store that you'll be able to go pick out what you want. I'll also be able to own and put my own deals. So maybe one particularly huge special weekend maybe oregon dlc rolls out and i'm like dude guys you get ten dollars off if you use this code you can get a t-shirt and you can get a trucker's hat you can get that for ten dollars off if you use this code on opening dlc not like that stuff like i'll be able to do that kind of stuff myself and give you guys better deals but also for truck company stuff guys that do stuff during the week or do stuff during the month whoever our top driver is whoever's our driver that maybe this month i pick whoever has the least amount of speeding tickets like all this crazy kind of fun stuff then maybe i can just sit i send out a t-shirt oh here man what size hat you wear or you like a snapback here man here's the trucking hat so i can send that to you so the trucking company is going to be something that you guys will get some reward out of so you've got that first off second one is the discord link so if you don't if you want to keep up with stuff here hit the announcements uh, and check out when we're going to be live streaming, when we're going to be doing convoys, when we're going to take off, when we're going to lead out, uh, those kinds of things. Time-wise, that's great for that. And also Amazon Affiliate. Anything you see in the stream today, go ahead and hit that uh, link. Go check out what I've got. If you add anything to there through my link, Go to my store and then click on the items, add those to your carts, and then you pay for them just like you would anything else. Then I'll get a commission from Amazon and it doesn't cost you a thing. So that's it. All the announcements, all the stuff's out of the way. So let's go ahead and let's, uh, let me throw some last minute shout outs here to us. We already got 100 in chat. So wow, that was nice. It was like 50 and all of a sudden it's like... So thank you there, Anthony. Yes, thank you, man. Deontay Cheney, what's up, buddy? How are you, man? Thanks there, Anthony. Appreciate that. The grants on the 15K. Big thumbs up, man. We'll see what it is. Good to have you, man. You guys are always welcome to plug in the chat here, too. Just jump in the conversation. Don't worry about shout outs and stuff. I always try to talk to everybody, give everybody a proper hello in here as long as we can. Uh, Dark Sun, good to see you, man. It's always good to see my, uh, our uh, our sponsors. Of course, I would say now it's, it's more like... Um, it's more like... Uh, um, not, not, uh, oh, what trying to say here? I got, I got sidetracked. It's, it's not called sponsors anymore. It's called members. Yeah, that's what they call you now, Dark Sun. You're, you're a member now. <laughs> yeah, I don't understand that. What's up, the O'Neill Finn? Good to see you there. Caden Craig, we, and then we've got Anthony Blair. What's up, buddy? How are you? Nightmare Ninja says, OMG, Mac Mod, yo, 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 I'm your best friend. This is on the Steam Workshop. This skin is on the Steam Workshop. The trailers, however, are not. And I'll see if I can't throw up a, a, a link there when we get done. Uh, but oh man, glitch fix, fella streamer here, huge fan, going to try this truck tomorrow. Sweet, look at there, a new member. <laughs> I love it, Gamer Dad, a new member. It's, it's so weird, man. Chris Huey, LeVar Ashley, we got O'Shane Miller in there. What's up, man? Michael Barr, Full Tilt Gaming, your videos are also cute, they go to work. Man, what a way to get started, uh, stream time, man. That is amazing. So thank you, man. Glitch fix there for the $4.99. I love how it takes the sin off. Thank you there to uh, Gamer Dad as well. And also, Gamer Dad, you'll have to tell Gamer Boy that I saw his uh, renewal come in later on. So you'll have to tell him I said uh, thanks for that. Appreciate that. Uh, Alex, yeah, what's up, man? Main out Outlaw Trucker, I'm good, man. Cali Gamers, uh, Chemo Beats, hello. Is that a truck mod? It is. It is on the Steam Workshop. Uh, and this skin, of course, is by Mr. Polly. 
There it is. Thanks, Gamer Dad. XTN. Appreciate it, man. All right. Let's go ahead and let's do some driving. Woo. Uh, is this? Yes. Okay. Okay. All right. All right, so I've got a few other things too for those guys that uh, that were looking here at the Mac when we had all those problems that night. Um, so here we go. Here's what we got. I mean, this is kind of a weird load, right? Uh, so we've got the uh, we've got the cat all uh, speefied up here. We've got cat uh, front end loaders. We got a backhoe on the back of this one, and then we've got pulling. I guess this is like a just a construction little pup trailer. I don't know, but it's cool. This is a Chris 45's trailer. This is an outside mod of Steam. Um, so anyway, that's what we're looking at. So here's the other thing I found out. Uh, we no longer am running MHA Pro. A lot of you guys had bought into that. I bought into that. It was great. But every, whatever they did in this last update, um, I also found out that Viva Mexico does not, the new one that they've done, does not work with MHA Pro. It does not recess back in. And also MHA Pro does not do automatic updates as things in ATS change. So, therefore, I can no longer kind of get behind, and I did not realize that updates were not, at least a couple updates were included. So every time you update MHA Pro, you have to get and pay another $5 for the map, and I'm not really about that. So, um, you know, if you've got it, don't update the game. Maybe reverse back to 1 and then wait for the 1.32 update. If you're looking at MHA Pro, download at your own free, uh, you know, download at your own stuff. I, I don't know what to tell you, man. So... Um, it is what it is. So, what's up there, Gold Nickels? Bob and Bond, good to see you there, Bob. Devon H, look at the cat Mac. That's right, man. The Mac attack. Chris Justice, what's up, man? Let's go ahead and crank this bad boy up. We have to get our. Uh, there we go. So we got our uh, got our cams all working today. Let's see if I can spin around there towards. I'll get all of my forearm on the picture. Turn our light down some. So my. There we go. That's a little better. Sweet. All right, let me uh, reset that, and yeah, there we go. All right, so this is the inside of our Mac Type R series. This thing is awesome. So uh, I know J Rod. I was, I was, I hated that man because I really did like the mod. Haha, -ha, Sebastian, you're, you're kid quick, man. I do. I'd have this different steering wheel. So what I have here, I'll pull this up. So I have a uh, deep dish OMP. I have an OMP uh, deep dish steering wheel, so it's on a wheel, a wheel adapter, plus it's on a spacer. Plus I've got my farm sim panel that is kind of doubling as a button box for right now. I have not achieved sponsor status with the uh, the ASP guys. <laughs> so, so for right now, I, I'm, I'm doing it on my own. <laughs> you know. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Nice glitch. Uh, where about blind? Uh, very top link there, Jared. Just click the arrow or look down in the description. You'll see it, man. Yeah, no build tonight, Chris. Well, uh, I've got a really awesome build that's going to blow your socks off here. I'm going to do a video of it, uh, and then I've got a couple of more live streams here with a couple of new trucks that probably nobody's seen. Let me, get, let me get out of here, get down to traffic. Oh, are you gonna let me through? Oh, look at there. A little nice little Chevy Volt's gonna let me through. There we go. Be good, Rev Brian. How are you, man? Al White. I am, dude. I'm ready for some Farm Sim 19. It's gonna be good, man. Max Mob, good to see you, buddy. Crazy Volvo, cool. What's up? Yeah, Devon, staying comfy in the seat, man. I am doing that, man. Yeah, engine sound in this truck is really nice, actually. Some of them do a pretty good job. Uh, and then some of them are, eh, they, they, they need a little. And I do have steering wheel creations on this as well, so. There you go, Shane. Thanks, man. Kids 5 and 4, what's up, man? Nice. I'm good. Gaming. Hope you are, man. All right, gonna be making us a right turn here. So if if you feel like you're too much in the cab, um, one thing that I do I do quite regularly is uh, since I have Track R, uh, my screen looks very uh, good. Um, like you know when I'm looking at something, 
I kind of look at this as, um, I don't know, I feel like I'm sitting in the seat since I have a wrapped three, but you guys are kind of sitting in here in like a two-dimensional looking at my center monitor. If you feel like it's too close, maybe on the second one, I'll maybe bring everything back to the center screen and then see what it looks like. You guys may enjoy that view a little better. I don't know. We'll just, um, every truck's different. The 389 is really nice when it's like that. Uh, but some of these other ones are a little bit close. So, let's see if it'll let us make a right turn here on red. But the good thing is I can turn over here and look as well. And once we get up the hill here, we'll, uh, once we get up the hill, I'll, uh, if she's going to pull in third. She going to pull? Come on, baby. Come on. Oh, yeah. She's got it in second. Got it in second. <laughs> hey, Devonta. What's up, man? We are in the Mac Type R Series, man. Yeah, Brian. It's all right, man. It's that thing choking up the hill. Here she goes. Now this is a 13 speed as well, so I don't have the luxury of having those first, you know, eight gears in one through four. So I'm, um, you know, we almost feel like I'm handicapped a little bit coming up the hills. <laughs> ben, what's up, man? All right, let's go to the outside. Let you guys see that for a little bit here. Hey, what's up, coffee? I love how it puts y'all as new members, man. That's so weird. <laughs> Whoops. Shame. Yeah, do some mini racing. Yeah. Yeah, I don't, I don't know about that, man. It's a nice looking trailer, man, even with the Mac. It's about 66 or 7,000 pounds, so. Old school international. I've seen a few, man. I, one of them I was having problems getting working, man. Johnny three times, what's up, man? <laughs> yeah, she's only a 375 horsepower. We used to used to spot these trucks up that are, you know, 700 and some odd horsepower. <laughs> there it is. Thank you there, Coffee. Appreciate it again, buddy. Yeah, it's good, Lamar. I tell you what, you know, guys that are, um, especially people that are always asking, you know, hey, um, you know, what's, what's the deal in your graphics? Do you, do you have certain trucks that run better? Do you have certain trucks that run, you know, bad? A lot of people say 389 really chokes their system down a lot. Uh, I would tend to agree with you. 389 even does mine. It's, it's just a really big mod. It's got a lot of stuff on it, so really a lot of high-quality textures. This truck, um, you know, for what it is, it runs absolutely uh, great. I don't know if anybody out there has the RTA stuff, has the RTA, um, RTA mods uh, Max Superliner. This one is very similar to that. Um, and uh, this one runs absolutely fantastic. Uh, and it's got a lot of great skins that Polly's doing as well. Whoops! Because uh, this is another cat skin from Polly, so you can probably recognize the colors and some of the uh, some of the stuff on it. But it's great. He's done a lot of other uh, great skins for this truck already. So there's no, no shortage of uh, good paints on this thing. So I don't know if it'd pull it, Lawson. I really don't, man. Taylor, I got my PC from uh, Digital Storm. If you look up Digital Storm PC, I think they're .com. Uh, that's where I got it from. Yeah, man, absolutely, call me. Absolutely, man. Kmore Gaming, what's up, man? How are you? <laughs> there you go, Kyle. <laughs> Oh, I've been trucking all weekend out here, Daniel. All right, there, Sebastian. Have a good in there, bud. If we got anybody that's new, welcome to you guys here. Don't forget to like. Don't forget to sub if you want to become a member of the channel. Already had a couple of renewed membership today, so it's cool to see you guys come uh, come back to the channel. Uh, and if you want to join the truck company, top link in the description. Uh, that is for our truck company here with FTG United Logistics. We're already about 58 members strong. We're looking for more people. I'd like to love to, to top the list. Uh, we got some guys that's doing nightly convoys, daily convoys are in there in the afternoon. I saw today there was about 10. Uh, started out the convoy today. So 10 people doing convoys, truckers MP. You can do them on solo, do them with mods, you can do them wherever the heck you want to do them. So you can use Coast to Coast if you want to. You can use Canada Dream if you want to. Doesn't matter. Don't tell Indy I said, hey, thank you there, glitch fix. 
Thank you there for your subscription. And Alex Nambo, appreciate it there, Alex. As always, man. Uh, we, we, we can try, Roger. It probably won't, uh, uh, probably won't be able to successfully, uh, just pull it, man. Uh, Darren Richards, what's up, man? How are you? Hope you're doing well. Uh, Glitch, we are running, uh, 6,000 by 1080. Guess we can go ahead and, let's go ahead and hop on over to the slow lane. Did Andy get a shout-out? Andy can't get a shout-out, man. <laughs> struggles yeah yeah she will man i mean ats so you people don't give it its due credit man ats is a it's a fairly big game especially when you throw some of these high quality mods now everybody's starting to do 2k graphics and 2048 textures and 4k textures and stuff man you got the monitors and the refresh rates to start drawing that stuff with the graphics cards man it's a it's a beast man it, it can get it can get big quick especially if people running at 60 frames you know i mean I, i'm running the thing with mine too is uh, the resolution of mine is running really good right now because I'm able to run and stream at 1080 and 60 frames, which is really good for truck games. It's it's hard to watch somebody uh, do a truck stunt, you know, at 30 frames and a 720 is just tough to do. So um, I hear you, man. I've got one 1080 Ti, so I'm looking to potentially adding another one here soon. Oh, is it? What's up, Taylor? <laughs> Hey, what's the ETA air thought? Let's see, uh, ETA four hours and 40 minutes. So somewhere around 15, 20 minutes. So we are taking the construction machinery down to Nogales, uh, which will be right there at the uh, south, I guess south of the border, right there, well, north, north of it. Taylor, I was reading your mind. <laughs> he's like, oh, wait a minute. He's already there. <laughs> yeah, it is coffee, man. It's old school, dude. I, I like the old school stuff. Let's see. I think I've got to get off here. Maybe not. Maybe. Can't tell. Uh, yes. Yeah, the Cat 660, man, I'm telling you, the Cat 660 is a monster, and I'm not exactly sure why. I mean, it's kind of a relatively small, low-poly, well, I don't say low-poly, but it's a it's a low-resource truck, you would think, but, man, dude, it's, it's packed. <laughs> Jake Brake sucks in this thing. Um, I didn't even, yeah, I didn't even put it in. I didn't even give it a, uh, give it a button. That's it right there. Yeah, it's such a shame, man. It's like... Oh my god, man. <laughs> yeah, man, that's right, Cody. Make it, definitely make it a hurry to keep, man. That's uh, right at 70,000 pounds, and this truck's really struggling at 370, I think, 370, with the 13 speed, so we don't even have the, uh, the official 18 pull-in transmission on this thing. Jackson, what's up, man? Saw your Fitch reviews. I've got a uh, shifter here. This uh, SKRS is from Maple Swing Software. If you look at my Amazon affiliate link, which is the uh, third link down, it's the third link down in the description, uh, you can see exactly where this comes from. You get off Amazon, you get off eBay, you get it directly from their store, whichever. They got a couple of different models now. Uh, I was, I'm, I'm in the talks with them, I've done some emailing back and forth, trying to see if we can't get you guys a code or get something there. 
uh, for some reviews of some of these things so you guys can actually see what they're, they're offering now. They've got a couple that's got the easy, the easy Jake brake on it. Um, good company to deal with though. Uh, I have had absolutely no problems with mine and it's been great. Um, and I'm assuming that if I ever did have any kind of issues with it, they, they'd square right up. So, why no Detroit? Because it was weak. <laughs> right hand. It was weak, man. Um, I think I've got the Mac engine in it, actually, and it's like 317, something like that. Plus, we got about a 70,000 pound load on here, so uh, she's, it's, it's giving her all she's got. A nice challenge to drive those. It definitely makes you uh, go back through the gears and stuff and uh, plan your attacks up the hills and not, you know, wait for the gear change when you're right in the middle of it. <laughs> Daniel, what's up, man? Uh, Cam DG 2010, I'm not exactly sure, man, how you change your, uh, your visibility there. Good inside textures as well, man. Everything's got this nice, uh, you know, luminescent around the uh, around the gate. Just looks good. Yeah, it is gorgeous. It's cool, man. Nathan Brown, what's up, man? Oh, the back, it is back. Absolutely, Dakota, man. We had to do it for another one. And kind of, you know, we're also showcasing a little bit of the Chris 45's trailers, which are um, a little bit... Uh, nobody saw that. Uh, which is a little bit newer. They just came out one through one a couple, you know, probably a month or so ago. Uh, but we normally really pull all the heavy stuff, but I never really check and kind of check out some of the loads down at the lesser end part of the uh, the scale on this. And there's some really cool stuff. Um, go ahead and uh, so we got this one here, which is really nice. I like this is a, one of my one of my new faves. So if we're already here. Look at there. So we got this one, so this is uh, two cats, we got a wheel loader and a backhoe, plus a construction pup on top of it, so we're like, <laughs> we are, uh, we're pushing her all she's got. Yeah, man. <laughs> and she's put her good. Never stop pulling, there you go, Bob. <laughs> yes, Scott, she is heavy, man. I love how we all assumed this was a chick truck. What happened? Oops. Yeah, I like the 3000 R's, man. Those are nice. I like the 3000s. It's a really nice set of trailers, man. Definitely going to do some. So, oh, so by the way, this is another thing I forgot to say. Uh, for those that are going to be joining the company, I am going to be offering a couple different packs. One for ETS. Uh, I've got as many mods on ETS, and we're running uh, maps as uh, south as. Ah, um, uh, oh, come on, Max. Come on, man. Come on, man. Come on. <clears throat> so. We've got a couple of different things going on. I'm going, to be, I'm going to be modding my own trailers and doing my own trailer skins for uh, some of our company stuff. So we'll have a few things going on um, that'll be, uh, let's see, we'll probably do a few things for ATS, a couple of normal trailers. I could probably do a reefer trailer, maybe another really cool box trailer, maybe one of those uh, doubles. Uh, and then we'll do the same BAK trailers for the back trailers for a Euro truck, which have a, a numerous of different kinds of... Um, looks and everything so even if you're an ets2 guy ats guy i'm gonna have some company trucks associated also with a couple of my most favorite uh you know trucks that i might run on ets and ats uh, they'll probably be off the defaults uh just because it'd be easy for everyone to run like the 900 maybe the default 389 or maybe vipers if i can get one uh done for that so yeah so we'll have a couple of things there so you'll have a company trailers plus some company skins there on the trucks to be able to run uh, some of those loads and stuff by. So I'm kind of looking forward to that. It'd be nice. Heads up. Just hang on there, Hyundai. Hang on. Hang on. Say I'm going to flip the front end off, too. Uh, James, so it says join. Uh, so that's what you're looking for. Uh, if you're on PC, it'll be a green button up there that says join. I, I, I hate they, they changed that because it's confusing now. People just got used to seeing sponsor up there. Now they see join. It's like, what am I joining? I'm already joined the live stream. So what more do I need to join? Which I'm totally like, totally with you on that, man. <laughs> yeah, all the trucks look good. Sean Durman, what's up, man? David Valenzuela, how are you? Gravek, what's up, man? Getting some last minute shout outs to everybody. All right, let's see what we got here. 
Let's see, I might. Let's see, I might actually see if I can. Let's, let's back up just a little bit. Ethan, all you gotta do is click that top link, buddy, and follow the directions. There's the fill out the application, uh, basically just sign it up for an account, um, and then you can uh, join the ranks there. We'll accept your uh, your application, and then there's a client that you can download, uh, and that helps log everything there. It's, it's very easy. Very, very, very easy. If you need any help, whether we got tons of guys in the Discord, it's already done it. They can help walk you through it and everything. So there you go, Ashton. Absolutely, man. Why do I record so late at night? Because I got a couple of kids, Jamie. And uh, unless you guys want to hear the kids running around in the background, which I would be my assumption would be probably not. Uh, between all of that going on, plus just my normal everyday activity stuff, this is the only time I have to game. Um, at least game in peace. How about that? So that one to go in there for the company. So that's cool. Let me go ahead and let me, let me uh, we'll make sure. And then I am going to, let's see, United Logistics. There we go. Truck book client. Uh, oh, shoot. Okay. All right. I did it. Anyway. What's up there, Riley? How are you? Uh, what button panel? Ha <laughs> ha. What's up, Kobe Queso? Uh, so this is actually the farm sim uh, deck. I know it's weird, right? <clears throat> um, so this is the farm this farm sim deck. It's basically got uh, 20, 24, 27, 20, 27 buttons, and I use the joystick to actually be my camera in third person, and it works great. Um, and it serves for farm sim. And it's just a generic USB button. So it was a half of what a button box is. And it offers me like, I don't know, like 12 more buttons than the button box does. Just doesn't have my FTG logo on it. So um, it works. All the buttons on it. I've got about, I don't know, 12 things that are that are set up on it. So uh, it's, it's a little bit of a, you know, it's a workaround. But it's a good workaround. Reaper, what's up, man? Mandy Moore says, hey, man, shout out. What's up? How are you? Uh, I not Devon. I I, or I I need to look at it again. Let's let's uh let's real quick let's grab us another one here. <laughs> we hit the cat pit caterpillar dump trucks. I was like, oh my god, you gotta you gotta gotta pull those FTG. Yeah, well. All right, so these are what's cool. You got it's got some really cool stuff in here that's not necessary. Oh, we got hay bales all the way over to uh, Ensenada, way over there. Industrial fans. We've got water pipes and new load loaders. Going down to old Mexico. <clears throat> yeah, Dakota, that's always that's always the case, man. There's always one or two. It's all good, man. Interactions are good, whether they're negative or not. YouTube doesn't care whether or not you thumbs down it. They just appreciate you took the time to actually click the button, man. <laughs> that's the that's the truth. All right, so I'm gonna keep it under the industrial fans might be a little much. I mean, that's just going basically where I went. So do you guys want me to cross the border and go into Mexico and grab something? Uh, or do you guys uh, want to see me, let's say, see something else here on the second second list that you want to see? Uh, throw it up in chat. Throw it up in chat. Says the rap, what's up, man? You know, I am, man. I, I've just put it off. I'm scared to do new games, man. Um, new games. ATS is going so well. I think ATS will do good because I've got a lot of... Uh, i got a lot of... Um, you know, got a lot of knowledge on the maps and stuff. I mean, I've got about six maps. I've got 22 map files that are in there right now, and they're all working and coexisting peacefully in one harmonious mod folder. <laughs> so, you know, um, it, it's going good for right now on ETS, and there's some good trucks, man. I, I still like them. I still got all the RTA stuff in there as well. So I did Gabe and KD. It's just a new wheel. It's still the, it's still the uh, G29. But I just have a wheel mod on it now, and oh my god, it feels so good. It feels so much better driving this. That's all right, Jamie. Haters will be haters. See you there, Leonard. Have a good man. All right, so I'm seeing the doubles, Mexico doubles. All right, all right. Maybe maybe we'll roll an ETS, man. Maybe we'll roll an ETS tomorrow or something. Um, 
Y'all want to see? Well, that pretty much leaves us back in to, uh, to there. Hey, Colby, I got something for you, man. Let me pick this next load up here, and I'm going to fill you guys in on what we're going on, what's going on here. Um, I was wanting to pick something a little bit shorter, but gum, man, these are so long. Let's see what's over at Sierra Vista. Uh, there might be something real. Hey, coffee beans for coffee. Look at there, and they're even going down to uh, Navajo. <laughs> oh, man. Old fishing boats here, automotive grease. A Komatsu, a D-155 dozer on a Lou Boy. Then we got the Metal Arc Beam, which is 97,000. It was probably too heavy for this. And thank you there, Colby, for the two. Appreciate it, man. We'll uh, talk about some merch here. I was just looking to see if we had anything else maybe that was a little bit cooler than hay bales. But if y'all were just like, if y'all were just like loving the hay bales, then we can pull hay bales. Yeah. Dozer, read my message. Read my message, FTG. Where where was your message? Oh, it may have gone out. Uh yeah, Max, it's because you're you're pushing other streamers in 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 my live stream and nobody lets you do that. Um it's just it's just rude. Uh I all right, I'll fill you guys on in on merch here in just a minute. Um Yes, Justin, I am. I did I did a whole video, but I went back and watched it, and I was like, this sucks. I'm going to have to do it again. So I might tear the wheel back apart, rebuild it, and then tear it apart and rebuild it again. All right, Jamie says coffee. Uh, so we got to take coffee in honor of our one of our special members here on the chat. <laughs> He's like, oh, boy. All right, where, where was coffee? Where was it going? Oh, there it is. What's the weight? Oh, okay, cool. 39,000. Yeah, we can do that. Sierra Vista. Oh, and this is the cool road, man. You guys are going to love this. Now, whether or not we're, uh, we should be able to. Do All right, let's see if uh, let's see if we can't go ahead and zip on over to Sierra Vista. Sierra underscore Vista. Hopefully, we don't crash out here. Let's pull our map up to see. Oh, we're right here at it, which is great. There they are. Look at there. Coffee Crate. <laughs> Coffee Crate Company. Woo! All right, so we'll set her down right here. And then we'll pick up, and then we'll make sure that we... Uh, yeah, we'll pick up and make sure that we uh, go ahead and make it daytime. We might be a little bit late on our load, but that's okay. All right, we'll take that down. So we'll see if we get going down to Mexico. This is you guys will probably enjoy this because this is probably the more fun uh, side of the road. This is one of my favorite drives down. It's a lot of curves back and forth, a lot of switchbacks, and some really nice, uh, really nice roads down in the Viva Mexico mine. Well, it's okay, Max. I'm not saying you disliked it, man. No worries. Some people don't know. If you didn't know, it's cool. Don't sweat the small stuff. Uh, Snail, we played a favorite explain the multiplayer update or SES update. Well, yeah, we can talk update here. Nice, Riley. Well, thank you there, man. This is the only thing Starbucks. No, I'm actually probably, uh, I mean, I'll drink Starbucks if I have to, but, uh, I really like a good, uh, a good local coffee company brew. That's my favorite. Show my kids. Oh, why? It's kind of freaky, man. It's like me saying, hey, show your girlfriend on the stream there, Jamie. I want to see what she looks like. People be like, uh. Dylan Toy, Dylan Miller Sanchez. Thank you there, Dylan. Appreciate it, man. Are we ready? I think we're ready. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead uh. Let's see. Let me let me do that. All right, now we go. Yeah, <laughs> probably not, Jamie. They're they're too young to really be on live streams, man. <laughs> I 
Hey, what's up there, Tyler? How are you, man? So where's the sponsor? So Colby, uh, now I don't know if you're on mobile. I don't know where it's at, to be honest with you, man. I, I really don't. Um, what I do know is that if you're on PC, it says join. Um, now, if you're on the YouTube gaming, I really need to look at this, but if you're on YouTube gaming, it should say, like, it should have a button at the top that says join. If anybody else has actually done it and you guys want to pipe up, then, you know, hey, go ahead and pipe up the chat if you have. What's up, Siobhan? How are you, man? No, this ain't that heavy. We ought to be able to rock and roll pretty good with this one. And, and we may just make it down to our first Mexico town instead of, you know, trailing this all the way down there. But if you guys have never seen Viva Mexico, uh, which is the mod that we're going to be uh, heading down here soon, you might actually, you know, want to stick around for a little bit. You might enjoy it. I, lo I love how Caterpillar just went to hauling uh, really nice stuff to hauling uh, coffee beans. Makes a lot of sense, right? Oh my god! <laughs> oh man! Look at that! Mac didn't even get any damage, just like they were just weren't sitting there. Nobody saw that. <laughs> well, look at there. See, it's pulled off. Looks like uh, everybody's good. Everybody didn't even call the cops, man. Stay for it. Nationwide is on your side. Especially if it's the T Bone side. Uh huh. Well, I don't know if somebody was going to use pulling an FTG. So, somebody wants to know uh, <laughs> what wheel I was using. So, this is the OMP wheel. Uh, and basically, what it is is a 70 millimeter wheel. And uh, I've got a 70mm uh, adapter to the Logitech G29 that I picked up on uh, Etsy, out of all places. That's followed by a half-inch wheel spacer. Uh, and then I fastened this on it. So I took all the electronics out, uh, detached them from the wheel, put them back together without the wheel being on it, and then put the wheel on top. I know that sounds complicated. It really wasn't that bad. It took me about an hour and a half. And now I have like an actual deep dish full wheel. So if you're doing rally racing, this would be absolutely insane. And I would say that this wheel is a little bit uh, heavier, but it is all cast aluminum. Um, but it's a good wheel. Feels good. It's got suede, uh, and it's got like a little yellow leather stripe in here. One of these days, I'll pull the um, what's it call it out. I'll pull the uh, chest cam out, and you guys can can see this wheel a little bit better. See you there, Jamie. Have a good buddy. He just something like pizza. Yeah. Well, it, it works good for a. Uh, you know, it works good for a, a what you would call it, a um, you know, like a rally style or a drift style wheel. That, that's really a wheel like this would be good on a Fanatec, Fanatic, whatever. Uh, will I get a wheel cover for it? No. But yeah, key hook it does. Now the wheel itself is just the the thing, like it's just the wheel. Like the mechanism behind it is all still the same. So I still have access to my buttons. Like uh, if I go outside the truck, I can move it around, but I also have my buttons back here. So I can still honk the horns, I can still change views, and do stuff like that. So, um, you know, the other stuff I've attached to the farm sim stuff, but, you know, turn signals, yeah, they still work. Oh, oh, we just took out the ground big. Sorry. <laughs> That'd be a good one there. Uh, we might have to do that in Greybook whenever we roll out to the, uh, uh, whatchamacallit, man, we roll out to the, um, Dang, man, I'm losing all my words. Uh, 1.32 comes out with Oregon. We're going to drive all the roads one night. We're just going to have to load up. Pizza giveaways. A couple of lucky guys. Get some pizza to complete the track with us. Maybe we'll do an opening night. What do you guys think? Type a one in chat if you would be up for this. I'm serious. If, well, we might not be able to do an opening night. But as soon as Truckers MP updates with a new 1.32 Oregon update or whatever they bring out for the Oregon DLC, if they're going to bring that stuff out, uh, if you guys, would you guys want to do a huge live stream with that on Truckers MP, like the opening night? Definitely do. Put a one in chat, put a two for no, put a one for yes. 
Whoa, good lord. Pop the Willikin out of there, man. Alright, so bienvenidos a Mexico. Probably not, Greybug, unless unless SES says, you know what, we probably need to let these guys have it in advance, which would be very smart if they did that. We'd say that I'm just saying SES, that would be really smart if y'all let Truckers MP get this and get it server ready by the time y'all rolled it out. That would be great. Just saying. There we go. See that, Riley? Have a good man. Hey, what's up there, Blue Type? How are you, man? Tyler Drone, what's up, Daydreamer? Good to see you guys. Hope y'all are doing well. Alright, so here's the Agua Prieta. I tell you, we're gonna. I tell you what, just because we've got coffee beans, I am. I'm gonna go over here. And then we are going to stop in here. We'll beat this stoplight right here. I'm gonna pull over here into the. Pemex. We're going to pretend we brought the coffee beans to the gas station. I'm sure, why wouldn't you? And then we're going to pick up. We're going to pick another construction trailer up. See if we got like a really oblong, oblong trailer, or something like that. Uh, I, I mean, I could. Um, pretty much, pretty easy. I mean, honestly, I mean, I, I just post the pictures up there in Discord there, Kobe. If you wanted some sensitivity settings or stuff like that, be glad to, man. Um, so thank you there, oh, wait a minute, I missed, uh, missed a guy there, BIA Trucker Pierce, thank you there for your sub, appreciate that, and for another super chat there from Colby, appreciate that, Colby. Um, yeah, I'll be glad to send you anything, man, um, you know, rather than do a, a necessary video on it, uh, whichever. No, it, it won't go in the logbook, because I, I looked, and it's not up, I thought I had it up, but I guess when I closed out, it did not sync back up with me, so we'll see something else, that was Coffee Beans. Um, so we'll see what else is here in Agua Prieta. So oh, we got some old trucks and heavy-duty forklifts. Of course, it's not going where I want it to go. Well, this one is. We'll take some old trucks. Hey, all right, man. A PayPal there from, uh, I'll put a P and G. So thank you there to, uh, to, to initials. I don't ever like to do first and last names, which is why I don't have PayPal go through on the shout outs because it puts your first and real last name on there and I don't like doing that. So they get there. I'll say Peter. So they get there to Peter there for a $20 donation there on PayPal. Man, big thumbs up. Thank you there, Peter. Appreciate that. That's, uh, that's nice of you, man. Um, you know what? Let's do this, man. Let's let us let us do let's do the heavy duty forklifts. We're going to drive them south, though, to Moctezuma. Are y'all good with Moctezuma? Can we do Moctezuma? What's up there, DZ Boy Trucking? How are you, man? Chance, what's up, buddy? Hope you're doing well, man. Oh, Daydreaming Chim from Thought Slayer. Ryan C, what's up, buddy? Uh, hope you're doing well there, Chance, man. Uh oh yeah. Well, hey Colby, just hit me up in the man, hit me up in the Discord, dude. I I'll I'll just see I'll just send you a picture, man. Just DM me and say, hey, this is Colby. I was wanting to hear your steering settings. I'll just take a, a, a screenshot of mine, man, and, and shoot them to you, man. That's no problem, man. <laughs> still, yeah. They're good. What's up, Dick Gleason? How are you, man? <laughs> We're still watching you, Chance. All right. Let me see if there's anything else down here in Cananea. There's some bee trains. A little heavy. Look at all that fertilizer. Good Lord. Uh, Caterpillar trailer we could do the hay bales oh let's do that all right that's what we'll do we'll do the hay bales originally uh, we can't pull the squirrel logistics trailer well, yeah we can maybe squirrel logistics trailer broke down it's going to need a ftg trailer to pull him out of his rut i don't know why i did all that snapping <laughs> mm, okay all right so now we need to look at what we got here all right so now i'm starting to run out of loads here I didn't want to get too far down here because I, I like this is my favorite part. Any behavior else? Oh, come on, Greg. Don't you, you want to do another one there, Greg? But come on, man. The FTG snafu. Yeah. Maybe Squirrel needs a, needs a hand pulling out of the trailer. <laughs> Forklifts? All right. See you there, Dakota. Have a good man. Have a wonderful Monday night. All right, so we're going back up to Phoenix. You guys want to... All right, tell you what. Do this. If you want to see me continue to get out of Mexico, we'll just get out and make it to the next city. We'll pick up something else in uh, Moctezuma, I believe is what this is. Yes. So if you want to see more Mexico, type a one. If you want me to go back to the States, type a two. 
Shoot it. What's up there, Pete Trucker? I'm good, man. You didn't miss much, man. We're just riding in the new Cat Mac attack. A uh, little retro, old school Monday Night Hero stream. Uh, nice little drive stream. We didn't really build anything, so. <laughs> they just says, go home. Go home. Do a heavy. All right, we'll do that one to close it out tonight. How about that, Jonathan? We'll do, we'll do like maybe one or two, depending on how low this, this next load here takes us to Moctezuma. If we do, then we'll pick up a heavy one and see what all the Mac can really, 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 really do. <laughs> Chance of light. Go, go home, man. Go home. I don't like Mexico. I would have heavy forklifts down to Mexico because that one. <laughs> it's like, God dang it. <laughs> All right, let's see. Is this an agua? Yes, it is. Let's see if I can swing this out just a little bit. I feel like it's I feel like it's all up in my arm. Yeah, yeah, what's up, Evan? Yes, man. Cat man, look at that man. Running a Mac attack while in ATS. I hear they're caterpillar man. I wonder what skin you're driving in. <laughs> yeah, no, they're not too, uh, they're not too heavy. Of course, I mean, when you got a truck that's only got 300 like 17 horses, it's it can kind of everything's heavy. All right, here we are in the old Walmart here. Yep, we barely we missed her. Good thing is we got Rainex on the uh, we got Rainex on the windshield, so we don't have to run the wipers too much. <laughs> yeah. All right, where are we going for our? Uh... Well, oh, okay, they're on the other side. That, is that Dick? Oh yeah, look, it does look like he's breaking in, don't he? He's got like a black toboggan on and everything. Uh, I, I, I don't, I don't drive real trucks. I would say I would, oh, look at those, man. Those are freaking nice. Those are really nice. I, those looked a lot smaller on the uh, job pick menu, but those are actually, uh, got like a quad axle trailer to pull these massive things. Not bigger than I thought it would be. I've only got a fake truck company. You can find that with the top link there in the description for anybody who's going to join a truck company. Or subscribe, you can do that too. Thank you there, Preston Madeiras. Appreciate that. Whoops, I don't think I'm gonna make it. Nope. Let's try that one more time. Getting it out of this place is going to be the challenge. <laughs> this is the next one down, Sawyer. Yeah, I know what you're talking about, man. Think of there. Is that Kaylin Johnson or Colleen Johnson? Yeah, Kaylin. There it is. Hey! Thank you there, Pete. Man, I appreciate that. Reefer right on. Thank you there, man. Big 30 Super Chat. Check out the truck site room at Discord. Tell me what you think about that load of logs. All right, man, I will do it. I appreciate that, man. Doug Sweeter, what's up, man? B Family B Logs, what's up? I know it's vlogs, but I just like saying B Logs because, you know, every YouTuber's got to do something that makes them different. So I just, you know. <laughs> oh, Shane, whoa, whoa. Wrong stream there, Shane, wrong stream. <laughs> Yeah, I think Amazon's got the 55 gallons on special this week on Prime. 
rain is falling. Oh, wipers don't work. Yeah, the wipers work. I just don't need them. Whoops. Well, at least it wasn't a swift truck. Well, we can't haul, uh... Like... <laughs> Nice. That's a Euro style trailer, so don't get off. Don't get all offense, uh, offensive. It's, uh, most of the Chris 45, most of the big stuff is a Euro truck style. Uh, Euro truck style stuff. Not all of it is, though. think about their bad company. I don't have cattle in here, but i tell you what I am going to have and that is a something that you probably have not seen and that is a triple Aussie style cattle train. Sup, learn to stream. Hope you're not coming in here to troll because that'll be your last comment. I'm just making I hope you've got a class of it. No, I don't know. I don't like to say that. Oh, dad gummit, man. Son of a. All right, we're going to have to turn around. We got to go this way. <laughs> Whoops. I'm the only cool gamer. Well, the... <laughs> well thank you, man. <laughs> I don't know about all that, man. But uh, I like to enjoy what I'm doing and have a good time doing it. So, yeah. I mean, if that makes me cool, okay. I'll take it. What's up there, AK? How are you, man? How's life treating you? Hope you're doing good, man. Oh, learn, learn the streams only guy. Okay, good. That's your only account. Well, good. We only have to ban one. He's like, wait, wait, what? Don't worry about it, man. Yeah, we forgot to go the other way. I forgot in Mexico all the uh, all the traffic really does queue up, and they ain't gonna let me in, man. You guys gonna have to like. Come on, come on, come on, easy. There we go. We're good. We got to go the other way. I forgot we're going to go further down Mexico. And I'm just going to take y'all right back to Arizona. Whoops. <laughs> I'm sure it's not a legal CDL there, Brian. <laughs> Yeah, well, I guess cucumbers are cool. Uh, they're cool to the taste. I guess because of their chemical makeup. Ron Wack, what's up, buddy? Shift is fast. Well, I can only shift as fast as the truck will let me. But see, uh, sometimes if you try to do it too fast, the, the gate won't open, and your uh, your load your, your uh, truck won't shift in the actual gear. So, Tyler Keen vlogs, what's up, man? A lot of vloggers tonight. I know, Cody. I was following the GPS, man. I was following it. Well, and I, and I said, hey, well, let's go down to Mexico. And, uh, yeah. And here we are, man. <laughs> uh, I, all right, Mateo. I'll, I'll, man, I'll remember that. I, I just, I don't remember all that stuff, man. You just gotta stay open, man. It's all good, man. <sighs> I'm a UPS driver. You got no mods in chat. It is what it is. It is what it is. We'll get we'll get it right though. We actually got a really cool road coming up, so we'll be on our on our way down to uh, 
And on our way down to Moctezuma's, this is actually a really nice little part of the trip. Oh, well, thank you there, Jonathan. Appreciate it, man. Well, you guys are having a good time. Don't forget to like. Don't forget to subscribe. Those likes, man, they really help. They really do, man. now yeah we'll start picking it we'll start picking it up a little bit all right so peter uh peter is that gagowski so let's talk uh while we got a little bit of open road in front of us let's talk a little bit of a 1.32 update so if you don't know what the 1.32 update uh is going to bring in so a couple things i don't know if oregon dlc is going to come out from that um oops so i'm not sure if oregon dlc is going to come out with that or not or whether or not they're going to be looking. I know truck trucking company stuff is going to uh, is going to be coming out for it. So if it does, uh, then what do you say? Well, what does that mean? They do have this on the block. We can sit here talk about it. If you guys got reaction to it, uh, please throw it in chat. Um, I'm up for it. Uh, but basically what it is, you're going to be able to own your own trucks and uh, skin them the way that you do your trucks. Um, so, you know, and this will be all default stuff. So if you're, if you're thinking, hey, I've got... Uh, you know, 389, if you can take it into and actually decide what wheels you got on it, you can decide what options you have on You'll have the same exact options for your trailers. Your trailers can match your trucks, and especially if you like doing stuff. So be looking for modders to be coming out immediately with a lot of truck company skins uh, that you'll be able to uh, put and apply on a lot of different things. Uh, so that's probably Numero Uno. That's going to be the first big one up update on it. Uh, now, there's a couple other things of how the economy is going to work within the truck. So, uh, effectively, you'll have your own company stuff, which means you can actually take your own stuff out there. So, I don't know whether or not you're going to have a, a, a right over the unit, going to have a lot of huge amount of customability, like with lettering, or whether that's all just going to be based in the skin. My guess is it's all going to be based in the skin. So, they did say that they've uploaded a lot more trailers, a lot more attachments a lot more of those things inside of the actual update itself and a lot more of adjustments to the economy for the way that you'll see your trailers and you actually see how the economy plays an effect of actually driving for your own company rather than just random uh, you know, truckloads so look for a lot of economy stuff to be updated with 1.32 and i'm hoping that oregon dlc is something that piggybacks on that or either comes out with that update itself if it does i don't know i, I really don't um, we'll just have to see so um, but that's that's the big one that's coming out with 1.32 as some more updates come out I mean I, what are your guys uh, you know what are you guys um, what are you guys thoughts on that uh, I mean I'm are you excited for 1.32 do you think the truck company stuff is going to be good um, literally throw it up in chat I'll read I'll read through some stuff here we can you know have a little mini conversation a conversation on it uh, yes Brian does this see your comment there on logging you are correct man Oh, Brandon, I think I got him from your email inbox, bud. <laughs> oh, Brandon Satterlow. Boy, Satterlow, that name sounds familiar. <laughs> Good lord. Yeah, we're going to be nice, man. Jake Brake does not sound good at all, man. Jake Brake sucks in this one. And thank you there, Kid Gaming Airsoft. Thank you there, buddy. Appreciate it. As always, man. Yeah, I'm with you there, Clint. I think it's going to be good, especially once... Uh, okay, so the cool thing about truck owner, trailer ownership is going to be... Uh, will be really nice to have uh, some, some really cool multiplayer event type stuff within like having truck books set up and having drivers and everything that way you can actually effectively drive as long as your company has skins for the trailers that's gonna be cool so that way you can just load up skins and be able to haul loads like you normally do but still have the you know to have the company feel to it so be cool andrew i have not man i have not 
Um, you know what? I don't know, man. Um, I mean, I don't know. I mean, I, I would assume probably not too much of that stuff is going to change. Okay. Um, I wouldn't. I wouldn't think it would. Um, if, what I could tell, I mean, they're, they said they were very vague in how they, which they always are. I mean, they're always like, hey, here's this little tease, but we're going to tell you a little bit of pretty much what you already knew from the forums, but we're really not going to tell you much. <laughs> Uh, they don't want people, uh, you know, going. Plus, we got a new truck coming in, so I don't, you know, people are arguing whether or not it's international or Volvo, like a DNR, whether or not you're talking international, um, you know, some of the newer stuff. I got no idea, but um, that's one of the new things that they're talking about with the new update. So, I mean, I don't know. It's, it's almost beggar's guess on that, uh, but I would assume most of the unload and most of that stuff is going to be the same as it always has, just because I know they had talked about how much they were actually changing in the economy of the game. Um, so I, I can't see them doing that much more because I think this update is going to apply to ETS as well. So if you're a fan of ETS and ATS, then this update will both come out for both versions about the same time. And we've still got stuff like the special transport mod. We've still got Oregon DLC. There's so much stuff that ATS needs to really catch up on uh, to even be called up to the level that ETS at. So I don't know. Hopefully we'll, we'll see it. So dedicated runs for the company that i don't know man I, I i don't know if you'll be able to mod that stuff that's they really haven't uh, put in two cents as to whether or not you're really going to be able to do some of that which i'd be interested to see if you're going to have dedicated runs between towns and have almost like a little network of stuff my guess is probably not uh and thank you there to dragon balls curtis there appreciate it man um so i don't know we'll i mean we'll just have to see um that i would i would seriously say that's probably not going to happen just because Um, you know, I don't know about that one. It depends on how far they go with the, the actual loading and the log stuff. I think that's what you're, you're, you're talking about there, AK. I don't know. Um, I'm, as, I'm really excited to see how they're doing the industrial part of Oregon DLC. Um, that's going to be nice. Um, I would venture, if it's anything, I would say it's probably a cut scene or something that's already going to be kind of already done. Kind of like, you know, how they circle around the garages when you upgrade them all the way. I don't look for them to, like, totally... You know, a big huge upgrade on that, but I don't know. Maybe, maybe, maybe they do. Chris Dub, what's up? Lurk stream, thank you for subbing. Appreciate it, man. Also, there, Chris Dub, thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, next group convoy is going to be Saturday. It's always Saturdays. Always Saturdays, 10 30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Last week we had 35, which was a new live stream record, uh, which was awesome. So. Yeah, I mean, I'd love to say we can catch another one. It's almost getting to the point where it's hard to keep 35 people together in a, in a convoy, so it's that to see what we can do. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm with you there on that, man. I, I, don't, I don't think they're going to get too far into it. Um, they'll probably keep it generic, just like us, like the garages where, you know, you'll have them loading in trailers and be like, oh my god, this is great. Then, like, the 10th time, it's like... Will I do a heavy load? Well, we, we can end up the stream here on the heaviest load that this truck can actually hold. So, uh, was that Coleman? Thank you there, Coleman318. Thank you there for your sub and also to. I'm crying now. I'll be happy, man. There's no sense of crying. And we'll do it Saturday, man. That's when we always do them. Alright, so we're now in Moctezuma already. Go ahead. That's right. That's right. All right. So we'll go ahead. I'll, oh, here we go. Gas station. We'll drop this trailer off. Let's see what we got. Let's see if we can pull anything. Man. Yeah, if you're going to... You probably shouldn't use your last name if you're going to meme other people stream. There, Chris. Only, uh, only Saturday I know in the world. What's up, Tiff? How are you, man? Tiff, man. Sorry. Have it! Gamer Trans, what's up, man? Saturday that makes me wet. I highly doubt it. I highly doubt it. All right, let's look at another one here. Freight market in progress. Let's go ahead and abandon this one. Let's pick up one more. Uh, you guys want to see about what's uh, what's what's a high end on this? We'll see. Oh well, 
It's kind of weird. It's Satterla. And then Brian got timed out. I'm not sure why Brian got timed out, but it must have been something outside of the bounds there. So. <sighs> Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. I checked my fault. <clears throat> all right. Let's uh let's see what else we got really on here. Well, they got all tons of Saddlers up in the house. Welcome to all the Saddler clan. All right, what else we got here? We got heavy dump axles. That could be a good, uh, that's a good one there. I don't think it's going to pull the bridge panels, man. I honestly don't think it's going to do it, man. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so we've got a cat truck. We got to at least haul something that's got a cat, at least something on it, at least down to somewhere. Um, I don't know that we can, honestly, I don't think we can have the bridge panels. We could try it, but I just don't think this truck's got it, man. It's going to get stuck. Um, yeah, Jazzy Cats, his overweight pack for ETS is absolutely insane, man. It's so freaking good. I, I sent him a message and asked if he was going to be pulling that over to ATS and I got no response. So I don't know, man. Uh, we could try the heavy dump. I, if we do the bri railway bridge panels. I don't think it's going to pull it. I just don't think it's got the, uh, it, it doesn't have the mustard to get it up the hill. Um, let's go with the, uh, we do heavy dumps. How about that, man? Uh, Chris Dubs, always Saturday nights, man. 10.30, Saturday nights. All right, let's do heavy dump, truck axles, Moctezuma. Let's roll that. <laughs> yeah, maybe. You don't want to see the deck plate sheets? All right, well, it's 88,000. That's going down here to Hermosillo, so we can definitely roll that. Um, and let's see what happens here. <laughs> Cat dump, just no way this truck could be able to hold it, man. The, P the, the 389 will barely hold that one, man. All the rolling coal mods on these trucks suck. That's why I don't have any of them on there, man. I ain't none of them on there. It's pointless to even put them on. Because I don't even have the big engine mod on this, which the big engine mod is kind of a joke. It, it's, it's not even the big one. Uh, we did cat front loaders there, John. We did the cat front loaders there, the very first one of the streams. So after this thing goes back, you'll be able to do it. So not running. Yeah. Brian, you are just back subscribing, man. What in the world. Hmm. All right. So let's uh, let's go ahead and grab this up. Yeah, but they don't look good, man. I they don't they're not they're not at least bit realistic, man. All right, let's see. These these are going these are going to push this one. At least if this road is like I think it is, it's a pretty good one, but it's back and forth a lot. So having these things in there is definitely going to test this truck. Is that a wide axle? Yep. <laughs> yeah, it's a nice one. I like it. Yeah, Chris, I think this is the one it's got like, is it 314 or 370? Uh, I have 370 sounds. Uh, this is the Mac engine. This is the second to last. So whatever these deck plates go to. Definitely got an all seat feel on these trailers. Nice, though. Definitely got a... Oh, it's, a, it's like a double. It's like uh, extendo, extendable. They got that little rail in the middle. That's that's cool. That's good. That's a good looking trailer. Some of these are surprised. The pictures they show up aren't really all that good. 
I have to have thought about getting a uh, button box. Honestly, though, for 300 some odd dollars, I'd rather put that into an actual rig uh, for $300 and rather than have, uh, you have something like that. It just, I don't know, it just doesn't appeal to me. I like it. Uh, you know, if you get a sponsorship through one or something like that, you get, get some products that way, that'd be cool. Um, but um, I think that's too light for the drug. I don't know, man. <laughs> Yeah, it, it's 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 decent pulling like this. I mean, it's floored, but uh, almost ninety thousand pounds, which is the old work truck, farm truck look. Yeah, unfortunately, it's a caterpillar. <laughs> it's like, oh yeah, that's right. I forgot about that. <laughs> Uh, shaking randomly? Uh, your force feedback in here probably need to turn your terrain and your engine down. More than likely. Josh Bruce, thank you there for your subscription, man. Appreciate it. Hello from Brazil, man. What's up there, Francis? Sick with Nell? Norm Grassfield, what's up, man? This is on the Steam Workshop, so if you open up the Steam Workshop, buddy, you're going to see this truck is going to be one of the features for this week. Oh, look! I guess that's when you've made the big time, when people are jealous, they want to call you a full-tilled moron. <sighs> I guess it's, uh, it feels special, man. I, it doesn't happen often, man. Yeah, I guess he's got a, what, about eight more? That's when you've officially moved into the Morton Salt Factory. Evan Talbot, thank you there, Evan. Appreciate it, man. Yeah, it's a shame. Yeah. You know, I, it doesn't matter, Jake, man. I, that, that stuff never did get to me. That's probably, we've banned more people in time for more people out tonight than I probably have in probably a year. It's fine, man. Just, you know, every now and again, you gotta clean out, man. Not a big deal. Come on, Gutty. Come on now. What's going on here? There we go. All right, now this is actually a cool part. So if you're looking at Viva Mexico, this is actually a really cool part of Viva Mexico. I have, um, I don't really do it. I won't say I don't do it too much anymore, but there's uh, bits and pieces of it I actually really, really, really like, and some of it I don't. And this is probably the more enjoyable part, just because it's a good bit more challenging, especially now that we've got an actual oversized load on here. More or less, just for the limp, anyway. It's not really, uh, not really the heaviest thing that we can carry, but it's definitely got a lot of weight behind it. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I don't know what happened, Clint. I don't know what happened, man. <laughs> hey, what's up, GFP? Oh, I hear you, man. They don't have a twin stick mod, no. They don't. Wow, the live stream? Uh, I don't... <laughs> you thought it was a YouTube video, not a live stream, so... I, I, I guess that's a compliment, Kappa Studios, I think. <laughs> oh, man. Not the best one to build a chat. Thank you there, Mr. Krabs. What's up, man? Oh, my God. Look at there, man. Another account. Said, leave it up. What a douche. Uh, depends on what you need there, Evan. There's a lot. There's um, so I pretty much make my look like a triangle. Uh, gain up uh, about 25%. Your engines, your terrain, all that stuff. You know, keep that stuff relatively low, man. I, I would start everything at 25 and then work from there and see what needs to be fixed. Um, mine feels pretty good, uh, but mine literally looks like a, mine looks like a sideways, like less than sign. 
So if you're looking at it in front of you, it would be the big end on the left and the smaller one on the, on the right. Um, yeah, well. This finally gives you something to do, Nick. There, man, you get to, you get to ban all of them. <laughs> the salt level goes through the sky high through Morton's stock just went ree. Caterpillar's right, man. Yeah, I always like Catman. It's going to be nice, too, uh, getting some company stuff done, get some company trailers done. So if you guys are out there, if you're still, uh, still watching and haven't hit that subscribe, also hit that subscribe, also hit the like button. Don't forget, if you want to drive here for the company on uh, with FTG, hit that top link there in the description, uh, and that will uh, shuck you right into the, uh, we'll get you fixed up there. We'll also got some other stuff here on the Discord as well. So if you're looking for uh, other things, especially aside to members and uh, members of the, disc, uh, of the Discord, the truck, all that stuff, uh, you guys can all uh, do convoys. We've got a couple of guys here, man, that are really housing a lot of convoys. At least, uh, almost, um, I'd say probably at least every, I don't know, I'd say every other day or so, they're getting out and doing some really nice convoys with everybody. So if you're looking for a good group of guys to you know, drive trucks around with, go ahead, hit them up. Say, hey, man, love to drive you, you know, drive with, around with you guys. And I'm sure they'll let you. Um, they're always uh, looking for more guys here in Member Chat to be able to come in and drive with them. So, guys, we're welcome to do that. Hit that top link. And then the second one's Discord if you want to, don't even know where to find that. Uh, just that second Discord link. That will take you straight there. Yeah, see, see, whoever said, oh, it's too light. Yeah, there you go, man. We might, we might be ending the... See the truck, yeah, man. What's up, Cobb Studios? How are you, buddy? Not to mention, you got some nice, uh, you got some nice scenery as well. Did you make these, uh, make these turns. That's the coolest part, I think, about the Mexico mod. There's a really nice place down in their new area, uh, and then what I heard was their Baja Peninsula was going to be completely rebuilt. So uh, that's kind of, that's kind of nice. I'll be glad to see uh, what they do on that one. So. Shifted in some listen. Some sometimes the gears in these trucks are not done exactly to the way real world specs. Uh, and sometimes you have to get them up in the higher RPMs for them to actually pull the load. Because um, even this truck won't even start or even pull anything between 1,000 and 1,500. So typically you're not going to push those diesels past the 1,500, 2,000 RPM mark. They're just not made for that. Um, but they will also have a ton bit more torque than say this old Mac does. So. Uh, it's always a balance to actually getting the load up the hill with ATS. It's not perfect by any means. So you can't always compare it to real, uh, real world stuff. It just doesn't always, it doesn't always work that way. Hey, what's up there, the big Zach? What's up, man? Man, boys, the whole YouTube channel came. <laughs> well, what's left of it? <laughs> oh, we're just taking out the trash, everybody. Hang on a minute.
Yeah, there's that one. Let's see who else. There's you and you and you. All right. Well, I'm sorry for the 115 that were watching my channel that wouldn't go watch other people's channel. Uh, evidently, they thought by coming over here and acting like a bunch of uh, sorry trolls that they'd uh, get the best of it tonight. But we ain't gonna let them. So I'm gonna finish out these load and we're gonna have a good time. So sorry for everybody in chat that has had to witness that over the past 30 minutes. Just goes to show you how far and how deep the salt mines go uh, in some YouTube communities. Even when I try to be nice uh, and try to let that go, they just can't. So. Yeah. So anyway, sorry for that for all you out there that are actually watching and enjoying the stream. So we'll try to finish out uh, and enjoy the rest of it. So anyway, there you go. Nick, do what you got to do. Thank you there, John Brock. Appreciate it, man, as always. There's CJ in West. What's up, man? How are you? Hope you're doing well, my friend. It's good to see we actually had, for this not being built and drive, we had really good numbers tonight. So thank you guys for coming out. If you want to, hit that like button, hit that subscribe. Uh, and then we will uh, we'll continue to do more. We got our big multiplayer is going to come up this Saturday. So feel free to come on out and hang out with us there as well. Also, truck companies, top link in the description there. And also a Discord. And also the Amazon affiliate link. You guys have actually been buying some stuff uh, and have done some things there. So Amazon has rewarded and have paying a little bit of a commission. It's not a lot, but every little bit helps. Uh, and we also, just as a big shout out to everybody, Andrew James came in a couple of the last couple of... Uh, uh, came in the last couple of streams and we matched donations we had 200 come in that andrew matched another 200 came in so a total of 400 on the friday night and then he came in and sponsored another 100 donation so that is going to go to and i've been kind of waiting to say this when we go into a driving rig uh so we're actually going to really do this thing upright uh get out of the desk so to speak and we're going to put that money towards an actual driving rig so uh, doing a little bit more research and trying to figure out exactly how I want to go and make sure that a lot of that money is spent uh, to the best that it can be. But anyway, a lot of big stuff is going to be happening here with the channel. Uh, I'm excited. And I'm going to have about two or three mods this week, some videos and stuff that nobody, and I'm including the big guys. I'm including Squirrel, including Jeff Fabiano, those guys that are going to have nothing like this. When you guys see it and you see the thumbnail, you're going to be like, oh my God, really? So yes, seriously, really, it's that good. It's going to be that good. Nobody else has got this stuff. So anyway, that's going to be coming up this week as well. So keep that all in the back of your mind here. It's going to be good. Oh, yeah, we got it. We got it. All right, let me catch up chat here. <laughs> Thank you there, Clint. Appreciate it. Thank you, man. <laughs> <laughs> Darren Curry, thank you everybody, appreciate it man. <laughs> Paul <laughs> last name man. Yeah, like that Jared, yeah, we 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 could be a man. We we slid in home fast on that one. It's alright though. <laughs> hey, what's up there, Jake? Thank you, buddy. Travis, I'm great, man. I hope you guys are doing well. Thanks for steady good visible. Thank you there, man. Appreciate it, man. Craig, what's up, man? How's it going? I'm doing well, man. I hope you are. Aiden, what's up, man? Jughead Gamer, man. Good to see you, man. It's been a while. Hope you're doing good, my friend. <laughs> okay, man. I'll take your word for it, man, Paul. <laughs> That's awesome, though, if it is, man. Yeah, well, there you go, Hook Surly. Well, good, man. Well, that's what it's meant to play, man. It's meant to play that way. Um, NCB, I... Uh, <laughs> I mean, I mean, maybe I, you know, most of the time it's I'm following the GPS uh, and I'm meaning to go somewhere else, like we did right before we got here to uh, Hermosillo. I wind up coming off another one and I wind up going a totally different way, and it's just because I never, I never put it on my map the right way the first time. So, 
Yeah, absolutely, Kabe. Send me a, send me some pics or something what you're trying to get to work. Sometimes stuff just doesn't even work in ATS anymore. Um, so. MG, what's up? Oh, you like the? Do you like it, Jake? Do you like? Do you like the full map mod? I'm curious, man. I I, I, I don't like it. Boat on the heavy load. Ah, uh, the hour and a half already. <laughs> Slow truck mod. <laughs> hey, what's up, Cat Trucker? How are you, man? I told you the logo, man. I, I told you what I might do on that logo was actually. Uh, I thought what we might do is just elongate that front end. And, and maybe we can uh, maybe we can skinny it up a little bit, add a little bit of shape to the freight, and just turn it into a freight liner. I thought that might that might serve you well, man. You might you might like that one better than the uh, <laughs> than the, the Peterbilt one. <laughs> He's like, yeah. <laughs> so, Brian Reed, how are you, man? Hey, what's up there, Alan Block? Well, thank you, man. Appreciate it. All right, let's see if we can uh, see if we can see if we can do this the old-fashioned way here with no. Uh, Don that lady, I have a sleeper on there, Cobble. Unfortunately. Yeah, it's just uh, just single day cab. Just a straight up, straight up old workforce, man. Oh, it's Alan LeBlanc. Alan LeBlanc. Good enough, man. I'll take it straight back it's good all right we'll see man we'll see what your application looks like it's really not that hard man <laughs> uh yeah for a little bit all right so i think it's gonna be it's an hour and a half is what i like to do on these build drives a little bit more so uh we'll drive the mac again um so i, I need to do a i'm we'll try to push it as much as i can there for for uh for raj you want to see a, a big heavy haul but honestly i don't think it, it's it's gonna i don't think it's gonna do it man so uh, all right there, John. Have a good man. I hear you, dude. Uh, I'm, I'm about to head that way myself. So uh, we're going to end it up here tonight. This has been good. It's an hour and a half good uh, Mac a cat attack here. Uh, so like I said before, if you want to join a truck company, go ahead and hit that top link there in the description. Go ahead and hit uh, the Discord link there. It'll be the second one if you come in. Uh, we've also got a couple logos if you want to put some profile pics up or you want to do whatever you can uh, there on that. It's fine. Uh, aside from that, uh, go ahead and hit that like, go ahead and hit that subscribe. If you can't, so thanks there, Comma Studio. Damian Curry, appreciate or Darian Curry, sorry. Uh, thank you guys as well. UK Goon, thank you there for yours as well. So, anyway, well, it's been another big night. So, thank you. We had a huge number here and still got 115 in here tonight. So, thank you guys. Appreciate it, man. Absolutely good stream. It was good. And, uh, and I have to apologize for all of you 115 here that I had the, uh, the really salty community came in and decided they were going to try to disrupt things. Uh, they didn't, and we just kept on trucking. So, you know, um, jealousy is, uh, whew, boy, that's a powerful drug, man. It really it really gets at the best of people. So um, so anyway, so thank you guys for sticking with me and sticking through all that and putting up with the mess. And thanks there to Nick T for cleaning up the trash and uh, sweeping that all out the back door. I appreciate it, Nick, as well. Uh, yeah, I know, man. I appreciate it, guys. You guys are there for a reason, and we never have to do it, but every now and again, like once in a blue moon, say once in 15,000 subs, you know what happened. So, I uh, appreciate it, bad company. I'll do my best, man. You guys keep liking, keep on subscribing to this stuff, and, and we'll keep doing it. Like I said, this week we've got some big stuff coming up, uh, big couple of videos I'm going to actually spend some decent time making. We just say that this one has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. This one has 15 axles is what I'm going to be doing this week. Ha! Yeah, so we have 15 axles. That's right. That's right. It's made up of three pieces. So hints, no more. That's it. So we'll uh, we'll roll that out sometime this week. So that's going to be exciting. So anyway.
that's it for me guys i will all see you here in the next live stream which will be tomorrow night uh we'll be able to, you know we'll do something i don't know if we'll do a build and drive tomorrow uh but we'll definitely do something here ats or maybe even we'll roll out and do an ets uh so you guys can watch that either way like i said truck company got guys that are actually doing convoys every day so if you want to truck with some guys have some good time and have some good fun uh we're already seventh up on the list i believe for the truck community uh we're already seventh in the company list so uh was like this is moving up very fast so merch is going to be on its way soon i gotta make the last uh make my last appointments here with the lady talk through pricing talk through exact design on everything uh but i've got some stuff picked out so you guys will have some merch uh and i'll have some abilities to give some stuff away and do some really cool stuff with it so thank you to travis king getting a nice uh sub right here a nice shout out here in here as well so 10 30 p.m eastern standard time been a while since when we'll do our live stream so you guys come on and hang out with us there so uh as i have man signing out from florida here you guys Guys, great misfit. Later, you guys. Take it easy. I will see you. Good night. Peace.